What up, everybody? Want to do a quick video? I uh, hadn't done a video in a while until was it like two days ago or yesterday, day before yesterday, when I oh it was yesterday. Did my supplement review on AHD and Rush Stack. Uh, so I decided to do another video. Um, tell you guys what I'm doing. Uh, as some of you know, I just got off of my six month bulk. Uh, put on some good muscle. If I have time, I'll put some pictures in this video. I got a couple um, of the final, you know, how much I bulked up, you know, pre and post bulk. Uh, and I want to tell you guys about taking a week off. That's what I have to do next week uh, and the importance of it. I don't know about you guys if you've been lifting for maybe a year or two, maybe you just started lifting weights. Uh, after a while or at certain points during lifting, your joints are going to dis a fucking gree with your muscles. There's no fucking doubt about it. If you're starting to throw some heavy weight around and your body's not used to it, which it's not going to be used to unless you're some kind of a fucking superhuman, your elbows are going to hurt like a motherfucker, your shoulders are going to scream, your knees are going to be like, God damn! So, it's important to take a week off and let your muscles and your joints kind of have a little rest. And that way, your body can recoup a little bit. You can get the rest that you might not have gotten last week. Uh, you know, I, because muscles, although, like, say for chest day, all right, I hit only chest workouts on chest day, but my triceps are a secondary, so are my shoulders. Some sometimes you know even biceps get thrown in there too somehow. It all depends on you know you're trying to get that last rep with the heaviest weight that you can put up. You might be throwing your fucking back in, your fucking shoulders, chest, your traps. You might be throwing everything in that motherfucker, your neck and your teeth and shit. And then on top of that, you got a whole day where you're where you're tearing those muscles too. So you know taking a week off lets all your muscles recoup and of course gives your joints rest and that's the main reason why I'm taking the week off my muscles feel fine I feel great except for my joints my shoulders are fucked man they are killing me so it's about time for me to take I can't even every time I try to do pull downs man I fucking ugh, it just hurts like a motherfucker and it's it's really uh, you know putting the damper on my pull down weight kinda sucks ass and I can only do a couple sets before I start to feel like in some serious pain. So next week, uh, the only thing that doesn't bother me is my knees. So I'm hitting leg day still. Uh, fuck, not going for an entire week. I have to hit legs. My knees feel great. Um, but yeah, just want to tell you guys about that and about my bulk and everything. It went really good. I went up like 20, 25 pounds in six months. Um, not gonna sit here and lie. Tell you guys it was all muscle. It's not. There was fat. Uh, but I did put on a substantial amount of size and strength gains for sure. Uh, if I have time, I'll put the pictures in here. Um, my current supplements. Went down to a little supplement shop here in town uh, with my girl. It's like a like a locally owned one, you know. And uh, I I thought it was just gonna be like a mom and pop type thing where they wouldn't have any big brands or anything like that. And for the most part, I was right. I didn't see any any you know hardcore sports brands or anything like that or anything that's really stuck out to me but get up to the front you know we get my girl some uh, we got some coconut oil to cook with and some uh, what did we get a raspberry ketone she wanted to try those out she's getting a little in the supplements too which is really making me happy and I get up there to the front and I look over there's this basket full of samples and guess what's covering the top of it BSN baby I got fucking a shit ton of BSN samples and it says, for our valued customers, take as many as you'd like. I was like, no fucking way. Hey, lady, can I take as many as I want? She goes, of course you can, honey. And this old, nice old lady. So I got like 20 of these bitches. I've already been taking these for a good week. I'm up to a double scoop of this stuff. I'll probably do a review on this too since I'll be taking about two full weeks of it. It's decent. I'll, I'll talk about it. Um, Hyper FX, uh, I I know a couple people who have tried it, and so I mean, plus it's a free pre-workout, who the fuck wouldn't take that? Uh, then I got two of the Synthesis, 6, the chocolate milkshake, hey I'll drink those this week, I, I already have some protein that I'm going to do a review on as well, um, then what else did I get? I got 
some shit that I'd never heard of. It's it's one of the natural, you know, it says like gluten free and shit like that. Nature Plus is the brand. GH Male. It's a growth hormone booster. And uh, I got like 12 of these little bitches. So, may or may not take them. I might give them to like my dad or some shit. Because these look kind of like for old people to me. But, hey, you know, I mean, what harm could it do? It says it has tribulus in it and a couple other things. Velvet bean, arginine, glutamine, glycine, lysine, tyrosine, um, tribulus, l -valine. I mean, it doesn't sound like a bad supplement to me. I might just take it anyway, man. Fuck it. Um, but I got like 12 of these. You know, I got like a whole package of the samples that it came in. And then, um, I think I got like eight of these old dudes. The Hyper Shred. Uh, and, I mean, this is decent. I, I tried to sample of it before. Uh, I, I'm just using these until my order gets here. And I did bad. I ordered from GNC.com. Ooh, I know. Terrible. But, hey, they had good fucking deals. And I'm not about to pass some shit up just because, you know, I prefer uh, other websites out there like Tiger Fitness. It was it was a good deal for what I was getting, and it's what I wanted. So, And, I mean, you guys will see the review on that shit, too. But, so, right now, I'm basically just taking samples until my shit gets here. But it should get here tomorrow or Tuesday. And then I'll show you guys my stack and tell you if I'm going to keep it or take it back because it was kind of on the expensive side. But, yeah, this is the little fat burner that I'm taking right now for the last couple of days. And I took some hydroxy cut first, too, because I got some samples of it when I bought my my protein powder. This is the pre-workout I'm taking, Hyper FX by BSN, and then, uh, haven't tried this shit yet, but it looks like it's bomb as fuck, and I've only heard good things about Synth 6. I also got one thing of their Amino X, and I love Amino X, If I'm going to take an Amino product, and that's exactly what it's going to be, but, uh, I mean, it's just an extra, you know, 30 or 60 bucks, when, but when I took it last, when I took the sample, I didn't really feel much in my intra workout, and it kind of bummed me out a little bit, and I'm wondering if maybe that's why BSN's amino product is so cheap in comparison to everybody else maybe they're starting to you know not take as much time in putting that one together I don't know uh, but alright so like and comment and subscribe and all that shit and uh, I just wanted to tell you guys about all this I'll try and put the the uh, pictures in oh and check out um, priceflaw.com if you guys are looking for supplements online show you the cheapest prices for everywhere and it just makes the most fucking sense peace